Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's tutorial, I will show you how to create a spiral using just geometry nodes and this would be super easy. First of all, using a spiral to create an array can produce impressive displays. Start with the default cube object. Just shift A to add default cube as shown here. Click on Jumpture Notes workspace to open it up. Just, it's great and super easy. We need to click uh, to click the new button in the header to create a pipeline. Have instance object in the scene. Add spiral node. Just first of all, click on new to start off working with the. Uh, Working with this default cube using geometry nodes as usual. So shift shift A in order to search for some important nodes. The first node, which is a spiral node. So let's type spiral. Just uh, once is uh, plug it into geometry output uh, node. There's gonna be making the making this spiral as shown here. Connect it together with an instance on point node. So let's search for instance to point node. Instance uh, on point. Drag it in between these two different th these two nodes, the spiral node and the output node, as shown here. So the UV sphere is entered in the object info node as instance object. So now uh, just to should disconnect this uh, group input node. Then go to search for object info, shift A to add object info, node, object info node, drag it uh, under this uh, node over here, spiral node. So just let's uh, connect it to geometry, connect geometry to instance, as shown here. Just uh, we need to add the sphere as shown here. So go back to select the vote cube from the outliner editor as shown here. So just plug geometry to instance. I'm gonna be selecting a sphere as shown here. It's gonna be creating the this great shape. That means the sphere is going to follow this curve, follow this spiral curve. So let's uh, just uh, play, uh, play with some values over here, like uh, resolution, rotations, for example. If you want to make much more rota rotations and start radius, if you want to change the radius, like this, so just uh, the start radius is gonna be increasing, decreasing, and in the radius, for example, let's make it much more bigger and wider, as shown here. The height, also, if you want to play with the height, like this, it's gonna be great and uh, crazy. Something so imagine how much time you need to make it manually and using modifiers but uh, Jumpture Notes it's a great tool with the different features and very fast to speed up your workflow you don't need to waste a lot of time creating very and very complex shapes as shown here so just uh, it's gonna be great if you want with rotation and scaling also if you want if you want to play with the scaling and rotation as shown here for example one and 
one. It's going to be creating this grid shape using junction nodes just in five or two in five minutes. You can create very crazy shapes without wasting a lot of time. And that's it for today for how to create spiral shapes in junction nodes. Thanks for watching.